these four years, even though they felt like forever, uh, they go by really quickly, but then you learn so much. And even though your journey feels like you will never reach the end goal, it's still reachable. It's not impossible, it's possible. Even though I started during COVID and it was everything remote, um, I was still able to make very good connections, even if it was online. I've made like the closest friends like that I didn't think I was ever gonna make. So I'm really appreciative of that. You can honestly do anything that you set your mind to do if you believe you can do it. You're always gonna find people rooting for you and somebody to be there for you and support you. Being first gen, it was a little bit hard finding what I needed to do to succeed and they were able to guide me. I really enjoyed the community on campus. I think your UIC experience is what you really make out of it. Uh, find resources on campus, find opportunities to get involved. Just just be out of your comfort zone and you'll, you'll find uh, what you're looking for on campus. I feel like coming in in the pandemic in 2020, it was really isolating and I didn't really uh, have anyone to connect to. It didn't really feel like the college experience. But as I said, the Center for Student Involvement really just connected me with all of my organizations I'm in now. I joined the acapella group, I'm clearly in the fraternity, I'm on the speech team. And a lot of my success came from my ability to interact with others and gain from my peers I usually wouldn't interact with just in my communication field, you know? I was actually a transfer student. And ever since I've came, I was able to find a community for myself through the study abroad office, through my fraternity, Alpha Phi Alpha Fraternity Incorporated, as well as Black Students in Business at UIC. The community has been great. It's so diverse and getting to know people from all around the world has been great. Honestly, like the opportunities were endless. Um, I really got a chance to really find what I wanted to do and really develop a community around that. UIC provided me with a whole bunch of resources. As you can tell, I was very involved. So with that involvement, there was endless access to resources, both academically and culturally, to really find my place here. I feel like being able to work with uh, people from different backgrounds really helped me find the kind of environment that I wanted to end up working after college. I think the best thing they provided me was the opportunity to really connect with companies in Chicago. We have a lot of career fairs in the College of Engineering and being able to really talk to recruiters and things like that was really valuable for me. I actually work at the library so I feel like that was my greatest resource. You know, meeting new people, having employment and also just like finding academic works that could help me with my assignments. That's the biggest resource. I was a part of the Student Activities Board for a couple of semesters, which was a lot of fun. Last semester, I really liked Sparky's Drag Race. Um, I was the event lead for that, so putting that on was really fun. UIC provided a lot of resources in like meeting other students and just helping to create like a nice bridge between like high school to college, especially during the pandemic. I think that the the professors at UIC, they really care for each of their students and guide you one-on-one -on -one when you need assistance. I would say, uh, yeah, definitely don't hesitate to reach out to them. They will lead you to success. <laughs> the career services was amazing, was an amazing support. The career fairs, campus recreation was also a big help. I was a student employee, went total three years there, and I would not be where I am right now without campus recreation. The organization that I'm part of, Alternative Spring Break. We were able to go to New Orleans and help out there. And it was really a great opportunity to learn about what they're going through. Through my department, I was able to speak with many various artists and also get a chance to like listen their point of view regarding to art pieces, which is very exciting for me. <laughs> From the spontaneous GOBA runs in between classes to the late night study sessions. Um, it was just all a fun time. Coming in as the eldest and first child of the family, um, it was very hard for me to navigate the university lifestyle. Um, 
but I probably wouldn't be here without my advisors, especially my LAS advisor, Alexa. She was so helpful and she always pointed me in the, in the right directions. Um, and then my CLG advisor as well, and uh, Mr. Mueller, the pre-law advisor. They were all so remarkably incredible and I am forever grateful for their help and support. Well, I'd like to thank like my advisors and like all the people that I met through UIC. It's a big city and I didn't expect to meet so many people, but it was awesome. Congratulations, class of 2024, you did it. Definitely pursue your dreams and live your lives.